next to me here is the first part of the console that has been built. Here we've got the four keyboards. Um, they look complicated, and they are, but they are nevertheless a small part of the substantial console that is going to be built. This is a really key part of the instrument because it's the main interface between the player and the, the instrument itself. And so it's really important that it's comfortable and that the player can access all the different bits of it. There are lots of small stylistic design decisions to be made, um, such as the size of the, uh, the, the buttons, which we call pistons, the even the typeface on them, the decoration on the key cheeks, and all of that has a bearing on how the console feels. We've also got, for example, a wide variety of different draw stop heads um, that'll be either side of the console. And we have to decide what's the best typeface uh, and style to use to give the console the right atmosphere and appearance. On any organ, the mechanism that connects the console to the valves under the pipes, we call that the action. Now, on the first Leeds Town Hall organ, the action was all mechanical, so the console was connected by lots and lots of long wooden rods inside the organ. On the new instrument, it's going to be of a form that we call electro-pneumatic. Most of it is electrical, and the last stage is pneumatic. And so these keys are actually just electric switches, and they go on and off when you press a key. And there has to be a complicated uh, electronic system that takes all this and the draw stops and the pedals as its inputs and processes all that and then sends current out to the right magnets around the organ that activate the final pneumatic stage.